Hello everyone, in this video we will try to visualize how solution of non-homogeneous system of equations are related with affine spaces. So let us consider a system of non-homogeneous system of linear equation Ax equal to b where A is given by the matrix. Suppose let us consider this matrix 1 0 1 0 1 1 and 1 1 2. So let we consider this matrix as our A, the coefficient matrix, and x is say three variables, so it is x1, x2, and x3. And let us consider B to be 2, 2, 4. 2, 2, and 4. Now, if we just try to find the null space of A, null space of A, what we will do? We will do the row, row reduction, row operations on A to find the reduced row matrix of A, reduced row strong form of the matrix A. So we start with 1, 0, the given matrix 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, and 1, 1, 2. So if we do R3 minus R1, we will get. 1 0 1 0 1 1 and 0 1 1 now we'll do r3 minus r2 so we'll get 1 0 1 0 1 1 0 0 0 so in the first two columns or first two rows we have uh, pivot elements, uh, I mean thus these columns are non-zero columns and these two first two rows are non-zero rows. So there are only one independent variable and uh, so if we write this we will get x1 plus x3 is 0 and x2 plus x3 is 0. So x3 is our independent variable so we can write it as uh, minus x3 comma minus x3 comma x3 so where x3 is coming from set of real numbers so this is our null space of a so let us denote it as n of a so this is our null space of a so the basis of uh, this space so this is nothing but the spanning set of the vector minus 1 minus 1 one so minus one comma minus one comma one is a uh, is a basis for this null space so that's what we got so basically uh, whenever we take any vector from the null space if we compose uh, if that is v that if v is from the null space of a then a v is equal to zero so these uh, elements of null space are nothing but the solution of the homogeneous system of equation ax equal to 0 but we want to find the uh, solution for the system of equation ax equal to b so for finding the solution ax equal to b what we have to do we use the gaussian elimination method again uh, so this is our augmented matrix and we do the row operation so let us write the augmented matrix first this is 1 0 1 uh, 0 1 1 1 1 2 and the b matrix is 2 2 4 so if we do the same similar row operations as we have done here so at the end we will get back to 1 0 1 and here we will have 2 and this is 0 1 1 here we have 2 and this is 0 0 0 0 so at the end we will get this this reduced echelon form and from here we can find that x1 plus x3 is equal to 2 and x2 plus x3 is again 2 and x3 our, is our independent variable so the solution set is nothing but we can write it as 2 minus x3 2 minus x3 comma x3 so this is our solution set where x3 comes from real number 
So all these vectors are in the solutions of ax minus b. So we can write, we can express it. So this is our solution we have written. So we can express it in terms of 2 comma 2 comma 0 this vector plus minus x3 minus x3 x3 this set x3 belongs to r so this is our null space this is nothing but the null space of a and this we got some vector which is let us denote is by u and if you can calculate a u so our a is the matrix 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 1 2 and if we multiply it with u that is 2 2 0 so what we will get we will get 2 2 and 4 so this u is a solution of this system of equation so u is one solution of the system of equation and this u plus this null space this is the set of all solutions. This is the solution set of our system of equation. So this is nothing but a affine space. This Na, Na is a vector space. Na is a subspace. Rather we can say it is a subspace. Subspace of R3 here as we are considering everything in R3. So Na is a one dimension subspace as we can see here. And uh, U plus that subspace is giving us an affine set and this this is nothing but the solution set of this system of linear equation, non-homogeneous system of linear equation Ax equal to b. So solution set of this non-homogeneous system of uh, linear equation is nothing but a affine space u plus null space of a where u is a solution of Ax equal to b. So this we can uh, get from this example. Thank you.